Hello Pisces, at the bottom of this deck um, is the big picture. This is, I believe, the Whispers of Love Oracle deck. The big picture talks about not getting hung up on the little details. That doesn't mean don't notice them, but it's kind of a thing of just because situations look bad to the naked eye does not mean that there was not something good behind it. Um, it's also about focusing on the end goal and not shooting yourself in the foot. Okay. We have got, you are worth it. This tells me that you have been struggling with issues of self-love or self-worth. You've been waiting for something. You've been waiting for your ships to come in. I just saw that. And it's like, you've been waiting for a long time, daydreaming about someone or something. And it looks like it's love, but it does not have to be. I feel like you may have romanticized too much what this love would be like. I feel like there's a breakthrough here and I feel like it's going to set you free in a sense. In that you can let go of some of the pressure that's been in your chest from holding in things you felt for so long. You'll be able to more freely express how you feel. <clears throat> and you'll also be able to receive not just give. We've got the intuition card. This intuition card for me tells me that this is something that in your heart of hearts, you have known for a very long time about a certain situation that seems very um, traumatic, right? But you knew there was a bigger purpose to all of this. And your intuition is right. You may not have the circumstances down to a T, but your intuition is guiding you. So don't beat yourself up for things that you've done. These things happen for a reason. Your intuition is your guides talking to you leading you the way that you're supposed to go. And sometimes the way you're supposed to go is not the way that society would tell you to go. Um, they might even badger you for it or um, outcast you or blacklist you or something like that. But you know, it's like an inner knowing that there's more to this than meets the eye. We have expansion I feel like this is talking about your intuition expanding. It also talks about your mind just in general expanding, opening up to not being so tight about how things have to be or about having to be in control of how everything moves forward, right? Because you're expanding and you're starting to realize if you hadn't already that the universe does have your back. And that one leads to the clear endeavor because I see her and it's a smirky little look. It's like I knew all along, right? So there could be an expansion to your household. There could be an expansion to your mind. There could be, um, it could be so many different things. But I feel like you have known and the pathway is going to be cleared as you expand 
your consciousness, your mind, your thoughts, your feelings, and really break away from those old, outdated habits of, like I said, shooting yourself in the foot. It's going to be a clear endeavor. It's going to be, um, oh gosh, my eyes just went straight to this wounded bird. So yeah, you've, you've been through some things, right? But she's looking back at that wounded bird and she is not only, um, protecting it and carrying it with her, but she's kind of, um, outgrown that, if that makes sense. She knows that there's promise. She knows that things are going to be okay. All right. That's what I want to say. And at the end, we've got love matters. So I feel like this definitely is about love, as I said. But I think it's about a lot of you have closed yourself to that, to love, because you were the wounded bird. But I feel like love is coming to you. But it's a matter of you being willing to accept it. And I think you are. But again, we go back to that expansion that has to occur here for this to be a clear endeavor. Love is coming to you. Love does matter. Accept it. Okay, she's holding her heart chakra. So you guys may need to do meditations on the heart chakra. Green crystals are good for that, or pink, like rose quartz, something like that. But I feel like you're going to learn that there is somebody who really loves you, like a lot. And they've been waiting to come to you. But there were some things that had to be cleared first. So that is your reading. If it resonates with you, please give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share it. And if you're not already subscribed, please do. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.